So when we grind, so when we when we grind the cam, we rough it and then we finish it. Uh, during the roughing process, depending on how much material we got to take, um, the, the cam can go out around. You know, the, the journals won't be won't be straight. They'll have run out, or the shaft is bent. And when cams come in to be reground, uh, you know, 98% of the time they have run out. So we have to straighten the shaft. And so I'm gonna show you how we do that. And I thought that would be a good video. So hang loose. All right, so we're gonna bring you in here and I got, so I, I, we have roughed this cam in. Andrew roughed it in yesterday afternoon. And uh, so I come in this morning and I was getting everything ready. And so I, I checked the run out. We just backed the steady rest off so it's not touching. And I checked the run out and it's got like 5,000 run out in the center journal. So I'm gonna show you the run out and then I'm gonna show you how we correct that. So come on in here. Yep. So, so it's low on that side. And that's, I mean, that's every bit of five thousandths run out. And we try to keep them under one. I mean, one is, is definitely acceptable, but so we'll bring it to the low side which is probably counterintuitive, but we're not actually, let me move the indicator out of the way. So we're not actually um, trying to push it straight. What we're doing is we, we got a, we, we, and I got a couple of these, but it's just old chisel and we make a, a, a blunt nose. So it's not sharp, so we're not cutting into it, we're just, what it's actually doing is expanding the metal. So, and it doesn't take much at all, but we expand the metal on the low side and that brings it back straight. And it's the same way we straighten the crankshaft or, you, you know, a lot of other stuff. But, so I'm on, so we was at five, and this is the low side. So usually we get like right up in the corner and, and again, it don't take much. Make sure it still is tight. Oh, we didn't. Oh, let me figure out what's. Let's see, we down to plus one, to just barely over two right there. So we've cut it in half with just that little bit. So we'll come back to our low side, which is about right there. That's less than a half a thousandth right there. So, and we'll check the journals on either side and just see where they at. All right, so, so we see how, how bad that one is.
So then we'll come over and work on this one. So yeah, that, that got that one down to three. Sometimes the the steel ones are a little more effort. And then, and then a lot of times, I mean, you, you can't you can't never really know, but a lot of times it'll just be the center journal that's out, and these two are, are fine uh, once you get this one in. So that's a thousandths and a half on on that one. But we we can get it better than that. I feel confident. So that's that's just under one. Um, and that one's about the same as the down to four. And that's a half. And then we'll come back and check the center journal. And we got maybe a thousandths and a half. So we'll work on it just a little bit. That's just a little over one, so we're gonna we're gonna stay after it a little bit till we get it down there where we want it. So we back we back to a uh, half a thousandths on that center journal. So now that all of those are straight, now, now we can grind it, finish grind it, and, and it'll be good. But like with these cores, uh, th there's a lot of material to come off. So we have to, you know, there's a lot of grinding. So it's a lot of stress when you remove that much material from a shaft, it's just a lot of stress. And then so it goes out of you know, it makes it have run out and then we have to bring it back in. But then for the finish pass, we only take uh, 10 thousandths off of it for the finish pass. 
So that allows it to, to stay straight. And when we finish, when we finish the cam, we uh, check it for straightness. And if it's more than a thousandth, we'll, we'll straighten it at the end, you know, just a hundred percent make sure. But, uh, but anyway, uh, I thought that would be interesting for you to see. All right, like, share, subscribe. Thank you so much.